today's video, I'm going to see if this thing works. This is called a USB Nest. And it's supposed to enable you to use a 15 port game port game pad or joystick like this with a USB port. Today we're going to see if this thing works or not. This thing is pretty old. It was made back in, let's see where, what it says here on, the, on this box. It says made in 1993. I don't know if you can see that or not, 1993. Right there, it says 1993. I don't even know if they had Pentium 2s back in 1993. It says designed for IBM PC 486. They had 486s back in 1993. 586 Pentium 2 compatibles. I don't think they had Pentium 2s back in 1993. Maybe in 1990. Six or something. Here it is. The box came in pretty rough shape, but uh, thankfully, this was not damaged. I opened it up and checked it to see if it was if the board was cracked or not. The board was not cracked, so it should should be okay. This is a sidewinder. Gamepad, which I purchased back in 1996 or 1997, I'm not really sure when I bought it. And it does have a, here's the 15 pin port, game port. This part would usually go into the sound card, the PCI sound card. Goes in like that. And you connect it to your PC, which I will be attempting to do now. I just connected it to my PC, and the light is showing like that. Now let's go to the PC and see if it really does work or not. It does come with an instruction manual. So let me take that out. Here it is. Here's the instruction manual. I will scan it and show it to you on the computer so you can see it better. But I'll show, just show you the manual. Very concise. There's four modes. It says mode one is if you use TMFCS or your controller is compatible with it. I have no idea what that is. Select mode one to select all functions. Mode two, if you have a CH Flight Stick Pro or your controller is compatible with it. Mode three, if your controller is compatible with two to four axis. It's four buttons, select Model 3 to upgrade your controller to a powerful USB game one. Four, Mode 4, if your controller is compatible with two axes, eight buttons, select Mode 4 to upgrade your controller to a powerful USB game one. All brands are tra trademarks and logos are the properties of respective owners. Rockfire, 1993, okay. I'll go back to the computer. Okay, now I'm back on my PC. I'm going to go to Control Panel. Hardware and Sound. See if that's on devices and printers. And it's right here.
here. This is the controller. Thanks. Properties. I'm gonna try to use it. I'm pressing left with the Z D pad. Nothing is happening. As you can see in the center axis, it's not moving. Pressing down, nothing. Pressing up, nothing. Pressing right, nothing. Pressing a button. Seems like it's pressing the buttons randomly. I don't think this works. I'll show you the other controller that I have. Let me cancel this. Properties here. This is another joystick for a gamepad that I have. When I press left with the D-pad, as you can see right here, hat point, up, down, diagonal, left, down. I press Y axis, X, X axis, Y axis. When I move up, down, it's, it's showing, it's centering. I'm using the analog stick, which you can see there. I don't have the analog. There's no analog for the sideboard. Pressing a button, as you can see, the buttons are working with the Logitech controller. There's 12 buttons on it. Okay, that works. This one does not work. It doesn't appear to, it doesn't appear to be working with the Sidewinder Microsoft gamepad Let me try using it on an emulator to see if I could set the controls or not this thing set see I didn't do anything I didn't press anything I press set it's just pressing the buttons by itself. Okay, I didn't really do anything, but it it is well, it's not working correctly. That's a problem. Using that controller, the sidewinder. Right now, the game's playing. See, I'm not doing anything, it's just doing it automatically. Okay. I guess it doesn't work. So now you have your answer. The USB, USB NES, Rockfire. Joystick converter doesn't work with the Sidewinder, Microsoft Sidewinder uh, gamepad. Now you know. If you have any questions, you could leave it in the comment section below. And also, um, this, I heard a lot of claims that this device does work with other joysticks. But I guess it just doesn't work with the one that I have. And I have no way to test. Um, this if it works with any other joystick that uses the game pad game uh, port because I don't have any I don't have any other game pad or joystick that uses a uh, 15 port game port okay um, if you have any questions you can leave in the comment section below and thanks for watching